Hi, here is the insight for today. I title it The Plan of Eternity. We spoke about creation being a precision of God's plan. And we talked about redemption being a plan work. Eternity itself is a plan work. When you read the book of John chapter 14, verse 1 to 3, Jesus says, do not let your heart be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. I go to prepare a place for you. And when I prepare a place, in preparation, we find the concept of planning. God created us based on plan. He redeemed us on a plan. Even glorification, where he wants us to spend eternity with him, it's also an act of plan. The full spectrum of God's creation, redemption, and God's salvation or eternity is all within a spectrum of plan. Look, God has been preparing a place for those he wants to save. This is the greatest insight to me about planning. Those who will make it to heaven cannot be a product of a planless life. It's a denial of faith. You have abandoned truth and Christ and faith if you do not believe in the concept of planning. You are product of plan. You are saved by plan and you will be redeemed or you will spend eternity on the anchor of plan. Here is the insight I want you to take for today. If the case is this, that eternity is based on plan and it is indeed, you can't afford to live a life without a plan. Look, we are even told that in heaven, we we'll sing the song of Moses and the song of the Lamb. It is all programmed. It is based on plan. Why keep living a life that is not anchored on plan? I charge you today by the authority of God's word to begin to plan. Eternity will not be for those who do not plan for their salvation, for their health, for their family. It is a place meant for planned people because it is planned. My name is God so TK Mensa. I wish you well wherever you find yourself on God's beautiful planet. I want to be part of your life as you prepare and plan to spend eternity. Spend some time to subscribe to my YouTube channel and that social media handle for more content. Be faithful as you plan for eternity.